In this video, we're going over the top five problems on this first generation Chevy Cobalt. Number one, the ignition coils. On this vehicle, the ignition coils are located right here. And when they go bad or when you notice them starting to fail, you're gonna have a rough running engine and you might have a check engine light that is flashing. To replace the coils, it's actually pretty easy. You just have to disconnect the connector and there is a bolt, just pull the coil out. When you're replacing coils, you also wanna keep in mind, it's always a good idea to replace the spark plugs as well. Number two, the combination switch, also known as the turn signal switch. And it also works the headlights. So you may find the headlights part of the switch doesn't work or when you're turning the turn signals that the return stops working. In that event, you're gonna have to replace the switch. Number three, the gas cap. The symptoms you're gonna notice is the check engine light on and you might walk by the car and smell a little bit of fuel smell. With the check engine light on, if you scan test it, you may find that you have an EBAP code. Take the gas cap off. Take a look at the seal, see if the seal looks like it's cracking. Also the filler neck, make sure there's no corrosion on the filler neck. It looks nice and smooth. And then check the ratchet part of the gas cap. If it doesn't feel tight, then it probably needs to be replaced. Number four, the shifter cable. Some of the symptoms you may notice is the ignition key does not come out of the ignition when the vehicle's in park. Also, when you go to shift it into a particular gear, it doesn't go into that gear. Some vehicles actually had a recall for this where they would put a clamp on the actual cable to prevent this from happening or replacing the cable. Other vehicles, you're just gonna have to replace the cable. Number five, the time and chain tensioner. Now some of the symptoms you're gonna notice with the time and chain tensioner failing is when you start the vehicle and it's a cold start that you hear a rattling type noise coming from the area where the time and chain is underneath the front of the engine under these covers. It's important to address this because you don't want the timing chain skipping a tooth or even breaking, causing more damage. To repair this, it's a fairly big job. There's a lot of components that need to come apart. It's an internal engine component. There's our top five problems for this Chevy Cobalt. Overall, these are great cars. If you enjoyed this video or it helped you out, make sure you subscribe to our channel, ring the bell, turn on all notifications so you don't miss any of our videos.